Okay, who are you? Why are you here? Why should we care? I'm Adam. I'd like Beeler. to start in a real friendly way. Yeah, no. you like that? <laughs> I don't know, I wouldn't care because I can do magic like this. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> My name is Adam Beeler, I'm with Scalable Display Technologies and uh, what we're doing is we're actually taking multiple projectors and allowing you to create a large scale seamless display uh, using the new NVIDIA API on the Quadro 5000 and 6000. And uh, basically what that allows you to do is take COTS components and build large scale visualization walls and add third, third party uh, interactivity such as this whiteboarding capability which you can see here that basically creates a uh, massive immersive visualization collaboration wow. uh, And actually, so, how big is this? So this wall is about 12 by 4 And, we're and using, I could barely, I can't get it all in and yeah. still hear you we're, we're 12 using, by 4 feet Yeah, we're using two 1280 by 800 projectors And we've got a little bit of an overlap region here Yeah. So you can see that it was automatically calibrated using a camera based system Everything's scaled correctly Yeah, everything's scaled correctly because what the new NVIDIA GPU allows us to do is to actually compensate for that overlap region and output the correct aspect ratio okay. from the GPU in the frame. Now, you had a, a uh, something we were looking at here. It looked like you drew on it freehand. I did, I did, actually. So what I can do is I can actually annotate on top of my slideshow. So I was trying to show that this is a demo of one of the yeah. displays that we've done. This actually has 16 projectors behind it. Wow. So the ultimate resolution of this display is 7,000 by 4,000. And what they're doing is they're achieving something that's 55 pixels per inch. So in every inch, you're going to have a really high pixel count, so you can't tell, so that they don't lose any perception of reality. Um, so let's say I want to show you a little bit more about what my technology does. Yeah. Uh, you can see over here, we've got a camera, which is either going to be a Canon or a uh, Logitech. Okay. And what it allows you to do, either, is uh, take multiple projectors like this that uh -huh. have a little bit of overlap region and create one single seamless image by moving from something like this to something like this. And then by doing it on the GPU, you're basically application independent. So anything you can do on Windows, you can do it here. And it's amazing how fast this thing's responding. Yeah, it's, it's actually it's really very good. quick. Now, now, okay, these annotations you put up here, are those captured anywhere? Yeah, so I'm actually, you can see I'm saving it right now. Oh, you saved it right there. Oh, okay, so I'm okay, to my PowerPoint. okay. So the other aspect of this is that it's interesting. The software that's interactive here comes with its own interactive whiteboard, and they have a browser-based service here, so I can actually share this remotely. So let's say I had a uh, system in Boston where our home offices are. Yeah. I can be working with my engineering team there. I can be inter interacting here, and with they can them. be interacting on this in, in real time. So and it's say, capturing everything you guys throw up there when you want them to capture, yeah, when you want to save it. For example, if you're an automotive designer, um, and I'm working with another designer who's engineering car design, and you know, we're working with the RTT product, which is right over there. That's the visualization app. And you realize that that mirror is what destroys the entire vehicle. We need to get rid That's of gotta it. That's got to go. It's a shame. Get it out of here. It's deplorable. You set, circle it, select change. They see this in real time. They can actually write a response on here or they can draw a suggestion in real time. Or they can bring up a new page. Let's say I want to bring up a new page. And they can make responses and draw notes. And then they can't claim that they didn't hear what you were saying either. And so the whiteboard junkies that are in every meeting and yeah. those companies that have the entire wall of whiteboards, this is something right up their alley. Save memory on your iPhone. You know, you don't have to take all those pictures wow. after you're done. And my sales team can't complain to me that they didn't hear what I was talking about anymore either. So, so. roughly. What's something like this go for? Well, so the overall package for something like this with the me mechanical structure and the mounting yeah. of everything, somewhere between fifteen to twenty thousand dollars. But you know, this sort of thing can be replicated easily. You don't need this. You can mount projectors on the ceiling. I just use two by fours. Exactly. I just go to Home Depot and pick up some stuff and some studs. And, yeah, so then you can fine. do it between ten to fifteen thousand dollars for PC hardware, interactivity, calibration software, and you're up and running. And it's, you guys sell the whole package. We don't. We actually just sell software that allows. This is software. You to, okay. So it's all done in software. So the idea is to allow people to go kind of build their own system using their own COTS components. So you don't have to use these NEC projectors. You can use two thousand oh. dollar projectors. You can use hundred thousand dollar projectors. Oh wow! So as okay. the projector curve changes and newer projectors come out, and the cameras are commonly available. Exactly. Very cool. This is great stuff. Thanks yeah. for the time. I appreciate it. My pleasure. It. Thanks. All right.